Okay, so good afternoon, everyone. So it's a great pleasure and honor to greet you on today's session. Uh, I hope you are all uh, in safe places. And uh, so our victory is around the corner. We are waiting for it. Um, I hope we will have uh, just a very fruitful discussion today uh, in this um, wonderful community. Uh, I wish you all uh, good luck during your presentations. Uh, so you know that the limits, uh, we have the limit of time uh, in Zoom 40 minutes. So please rejoin. Yeah, so after our meeting finishes every 40 minutes. Also comply with the requirements of um, the conference. So uh, you have up to 15 minutes uh, to present your uh, research. And of course, you are welcome to ask any questions after uh, each presenter. So after each presentation uh, will take place and the presenter will be uh, happy to answer the questions. So uh, let's start. So the first presenter is Johan Copriano. Uh, so with his research, computer assisted, assisted linguistic researches on the basis of Spanish dictionary text. So Kharkiv National University, please, you can start. Thank you very much. Can you hear me and see my presentation? Yes. Mm -hmm. uh, so hello, everyone. Uh, and uh, I'd like uh, to uh, present uh, my report uh, devoted on my um, uh, linguistic research and my research interests uh, and uh, one of the aspects uh, are computer assisted uh, linguistic researches on the basis of uh, Spanish dictionary text. Uh, well, uh, 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 fundamental uh, explanatory dictionaries uh, of uh, national languages are of primary interest for linguistic experts. Um, so, uh, however, uh, the dictionaries that uh, actively use uh, corpus technologies for their creation and update uh, remain underestimated in regards to their research uh, potential. Uh, so, uh, the main focus uh, of the report is uh, to show how research uh, potential can be uh, of the dictionary uh, can be uh, developed uh, using uh, a technology of a uh, virtual lexicographic laboratories uh, that uh, have been uh, uh, elaborated uh, uh, in a Ukrainian National uh, uh, Lingua Information Fund uh, in uh, Kyiv. Uh, so, um, uh, uh, so the goal of our paper is uh, to highlight important aspects of uh, using uh, research tools uh, while conducting uh, linguistic researches uh, based on the uh, text uh, of the Spanish uh, dictionary. Uh, and uh, we would like uh, to focus on uh, some of the aspects of creating such uh, tools, uh, namely uh, the method uh, which our research is based on, uh, lexicographic um, data model, which forms the basis of the lexicographic database, and uh, currently available interfaces to extract linguistic information. And uh, at the end of my report, I will show uh, the screenshots uh, demonstrating uh, the use of uh, the research tools. Uh, for our research purpose, we uh, choose a Spanish language dictionary published by the uh, Royal Academy of Spanish. Uh, we set the goal to design and implement uh, linguistic tools for analyzing uh, digital uh, dictionary text. Uh, our interest in uh, Spanish dictionary is arisen by uh, the international status of the Spanish language, uh, credibility and academic status of the dictionary, um, are the school of uh, lexicography that differs from Ukrainian English uh, uh, schools. And uh, another and also important reason of choosing this uh, dictionary is the availability of its uh, digital version that uh, supports uh, HTML5 format. 
the letter guarantees the authenticity of the dictionary text and allows uh, uh, to uh, focus our attention on the structure of the uh, dictionary entry. So, uh, effective solution uh, of the problem uh, of the problem uh, requires a general theoretical basis or uh, framework uh, uh, to describe the widest possible range uh, of uh, lexicographic objects. As such, we use the theory of uh, lexicographic uh, systems uh, developed and proposed by the uh, Ukrainian uh, academician Volodymyr Shirokov. Uh, we, we consider uh, the lexicographic system uh, as a special informational, uh, semiotic, and uh, semantic uh, system in which a uh, lexicographic effect or a certain uh, combination of lexicographic effects uh, is uh, induced. Uh, we consider the dictionary as a lexicographic system of special type with a set of language units and set of their uh, descriptions. So uh, this uh, frame shows in a simplified form uh, a model of uh, the lexicographic uh, systems uh, to be applied for a uh, dictionary in uh, question. Uh, so uh, the first uh, uh, element of this uh, model means a set of uh, elementary uh, informational units. In this case, uh, this is uh, the units uh, which compose the word list, the dictionary word list. Uh, uh, second uh, element uh, uh, is um, a set of uh, descriptions. And B and sigma B uh, are uh, the uh, elements that form in the set of uh, descriptions. Uh, and uh, next, uh, mechanism of uh, recursive uh, reduction uh, that uh, uh, divides uh, the me this mechanism uh, divides uh, uh, decomposes uh, lexicographic structure of uh, our dictionary to the uh, smallest uh, possible elements. Uh, so um, uh, uh, on uh, 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 the basis uh, of the uh, theory, we have developed uh, the technology uh, technology to extract uh, dictionary text from uh, online version uh, of Spanish language. Uh, then uh, the text uh, ha has been marked uh, up. Uh, uh, so. Uh, um, and, uh, uh, and uh, uh, the uh, marking uh, text uh, has been performed on the basis of the entry text analysis, and then uh, uh, entry uh, structure. Uh, and uh, uh, the final stage was uh, to uh, convert uh, the uh, marked up uh, text uh, into uh, database uh, format with appropriate uh, interface to uh, manage the uh, text of the uh, dictionary, uh, Spanish dictionary. Uh, so uh, here, uh, here are the element information elements um, uh, of uh, the uh, dictionary uh, text uh, that are accessible uh, from the uh, from the interface that can be accessed uh, by the user while performing. Uh, linguistic uh, researches. And uh, let me show uh, some uh, screenshots um, uh, demonstrating uh, the uh, 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 tools that uh, have uh, been elaborated by, uh, by the researchers in uh, Ukrainian Lingua Information Fund for uh, Spanish uh, Dictionary. So this is um, the um, the, uh, this is uh, uh, the example. How can we make a sample of homonymic affixes and uh, uh, on the left? So and uh, parameters uh, chosen. Uh, so we uh, can um, uh, first uh, possibility using our uh, tools uh, is uh, to um, uh, may uh, to uh, study. 
Spanish language uh, composition, uh, Spanish language vocabulary, its composition, its main elements. We can also uh, uh, make uh, samples uh, of uh, homonymic words, uh, for example, um, make a, a sample of uh, uh, foreign words, uh, etc. Uh, so uh, we also we can also, for example, uh, make a sample of uh, the head words uh, uh, that uh, have different uh, gender forms. Uh, so here uh, on the left uh, there is a, a list of uh, these words and uh, uh, chosen parameters uh, on the right. Uh, uh, next, uh, uh, with our tools, we can um, uh, perform analysis uh, of uh, morphological characteristics uh, of the uh, head words. Uh, for example, uh, we can uh, we can uh, make a sample of head words that are uh, defined uh, in uh, the uh, dictionary uh, as action, the effect of the action and effect of uh, so uh, we can uh, make uh, some uh, conclusions uh, uh, which uh, Spanish suffixes are used uh, to uh, form the words uh, that are uh, that have the meaning acción y efecto de. So uh, the, uh, on the basis of the results, uh, so the results uh, on the basis uh, of the sample analysis uh, we can um, uh, we can uh, highlight uh, mark out uh, the Spanish suffixes uh, shown on the uh, table uh, so uh, uh, this is the example of uh, verbal nouns uh, uh, the nouns formed uh, on the basis of the verbs on the uh, third column uh, with um, uh, 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 then we can also, on the basis of the uh, dictionary text, uh, um, draw out uh, uh, the head words composing some lexical, some lexical semantic uh, classes. Uh, for example, this uh, slide uh, shows uh, 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 the uh, sample. Uh, of uh, head words composing a uh, lexical semantical class uh, embarcacion uh, ship uh, in Spanish. So uh, we can uh, uh, so the uh, program um, display uh, the program displays uh, all uh, Spanish words that uh, define the uh, types of the uh, ships um, uh, types of the uh, ships. Uh, uh, described in the uh, Spanish dictionary. So uh, uh, here uh, we can, uh, uh, on uh, the basis uh, of uh, the sample, we can uh, perform a component analysis and uh, the result of this uh, analysis is uh, represented in this uh, slide. So uh, we can uh, so we can see that a lexical semantical class uh, is composed by the uh, words uh, denoting uh, that have a meaning, lexical meaning sheet. Uh, and uh, uh, here uh, we made a list of the differential themes. Mm. Uh, and uh, um, and uh, the last uh, moment that uh, with uh, uh, our tools, we can draw out uh, a, a sample of head verbs that form in some uh, collocations. Here we, I presented uh, uh, the collocations uh, that uh, our program um, extracted from the uh, dictionary uh, texts uh, with construction, noun, plus, uh, the credit. So uh, we can uh, we uh, do our extracted um, collocations uh, that uh, end with the credit. Uh, for, uh, for example, card de credito, credit card, uh, uh, cuenta de credito, uh, credit account. Uh, uh, so 
Uh, so uh, uh, the current uh, interface uh, of the uh, program of uh, our uh, the current interface uh, uh, allows uh, performing uh, Spanish language uh, vocabulary analysis, studying morphological features, uh, anal analyzing the words that have common lexical meaning, and uh, combinatorial features of uh, head words. But uh, I'd like uh, to say that. Uh, uh, the mm, program uh, is uh, still underway, uh, and uh, there may be some uh, limits or restrictions on uh, using our uh, research tools to perform uh, Spanish language investigations. Uh, thank you very much. Thank you. So questions, you're welcome to ask. Dear participants, any questions? If no, I have a question. Have you encountered any problems while carrying out your research and just doing it in details? or grouping mm -hmm. maybe to different classes? Were there any words that you couldn't group? Uh, yes, um, I uh, encountered uh, some uh, problems um, uh, connected with um, uh, irrelevant head words. So uh, for example, if we investigated, uh, um, yeah, if we wanted uh, to uh, make a sample of the words denoting certain types of the ships, uh, some irrelevant head words, for example, that denotes parts of the sheep, for example, and uh, 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 persons uh, who uh, uh, make uh, uh, services on the ships, uh, uh, we could see in the sample. But we uh, wanted only types of ships and uh, nothing more. Uh, so, uh, so the problem that uh, remains is uh, uh, irrelevant words, and uh, this is connected that uh, not all uh, elements are indexed, not all information elements are indexed, uh, so we, uh, we work how to uh, make a tool, uh, some uh, technical solutions uh, that uh, allow making the user's queries more accurate so uh, so that is the problem thank you thank you any other questions you can also write the questions in the chat if you like so if no thank you for your contri contribution and mm -hmm. please so the next speaker or speakers Svetlana Hrecena and Oksana Nika, a frequently dic frequency dictionary of proper names in a 17th century original text, Taras Shevchenko National University of Kyiv. Do we have the presenters? Uh, yeah, uh, we have the presenter. Um, it's uh, me. Uh, good afternoon, dear colleagues. Uh, could you see my screen? Yes. Yeah. Um, okay. One moment, please. Um, let me present to your attention the paper entitled A Frequency Dictionary of Proper Names in a 17th century original text by Oksana Nika and Svetlana Hrycina from Tarasvchenko National University of uh, Kyiv. Uh, in this paper, we have shown the features of uh, our work at different stages of creating the frequency dictionary of proper names in a 17th century original text from preparing the ancient original text, compiling the dictionary of proper names, classification of proper names into groups, to the calculating the frequency of proper names in the text and presentation of the obtained results in a dictionary constructed in the descending frequency order. The objectives of the paper are uh, demonstrating the novelty of compiling the frequency dictionary of proper names in early modern texts, 
describing the stages of frequency dictionary compilation and uh, their application to original ancient texts, specifying the preparatory stage of dictionary compilation and the principles of tokenization of Cyrillic 17th century texts, uh, showing the specificities of stemming and lemmatization with regard to phonetic, orthographic, and grammatical word and word form variation, and discussing the text frequency of proper name use, frequency discrepancies, division into groups and subgroups. Uh, this uh, frequency dictionary is historical. Uh, its compilation um, and results focus on describing the characteristic of the genre, it's a sermon cultural model, uh, Baroque and period, it's early modern period, 17th century. Uh, the text is monolingual, a uh, Russian language with reference to ways of rendering proper names from other languages uh, we are Latin. The novelty of the scientific problem is in supplementing and adjusting certain stages in the algorithm for compiling a frequency dictionary of proper names in view of the historical specificities of the text, uh, the diacritics, variance, graphics, orthography, features of the text generation, the necessity for correlation with texts of different genres, corpus-related research, comparison of corpora. Uh, their obtained results can be used for theoretical and applied works, as well as in the teaching of statistical, corpus linguistics, history of language, lexicography, linguistic and statistical parameterization of the 17th century originals can be used uh, as well to study other genres in uh, synchrony and diachrony. Uh, the main methods and techniques employed in the study are methods of quantitative and statistical analysis, uh, combining quantitative methods uh, to determine the number of proper names, uh, frequency of their use in the text, uh, their division into groups and subgroups, creating a frequency dictionary of proper names in a 17th century original text, frequency discrepancies in proper name use. Um, we used as well uh, distributional analysis, componential analysis, and uh, descriptive uh, method. Uh, the genre of sermon uh, was well developed in early modern Europe. Oriented towards the audience of different social status, the sermon explicated precedent proper names. Antoni Radovelovsky was one of the popular 17th century authors who combined in his writings European model and key literary traditions. Radovelovsky was unique in expanding the range of proper names used in his sermons, which was influenced by the broad variety of source and Baroque character of presentation. Uh, here you can uh, see uh, the, text, the textual basis for uh, the frequency dictionary of proper names. Uh, is there, uh, this is the publication uh, Radovilovsky Antoni, um, Baroque Sermons of the 17th century by Oksana Nika and uh, Yulia Olashko. Um, the frequency dictionary is based on the 17th century texts. Uh, index and dictionary uh, of proper names containing headwords uh, and their meaning both primary and secondary with contexts given. The 17th century original texts, um, uh, these are 23 sermons covering 226 pages in total have been reproduced through metagraphy. Um, on the uh, right uh, side of uh, the screen, you can see the metagraphed uh, text. Uh, it's the ancient text publication with the maximum saving of the original features. Um, and uh, here you can see the uh, original. Uh, this uh, text uh, come from the collections Ogorodok Marie Bogorodice, The Garden of Virgin Mary, dated 1676, and Vinet Christol, The Rest of Christ, uh, dated 1688, as well as their manuscript versions, 
uh, dating to uh, 1671 and uh, the period in range of 1676-1683. Uh, they are kept in the Department of Early Printed Books and Rare Publications and the, at the Manuscript Institute of the Vernadsky National Library of Ukraine. Uh, as for the scenes uh, of the sermons, uh, most of uh, them are festive ones, while two of them are war themed. Um, their uh, work with the text started with its tokenization. Um, since proponents were uh, of primary interest, all manipulations in the text, such as removal of syntactic characters, the removal of tilde, um, were made only with proper names. It should be noted that uh, margin notes, so-called glosses, weren't taken into account for the calculation purposes. Um, also, um, was a uh, very important uh, proper uh, name homonymy. Uh, it's one. Uh, it's quite frequent phenomenon and. Uh, um, it was addressed by adding a special character sorry to distinguish homonyms. For instance, proper name uh, Noe, Noe, and word combinations Tori Noe, Novi Noe um, were put into different groups. In the first case, the proper name Noe, uh, Noe uh, belongs to the uh, subgroup of biblical uh, anthroponyms. In the second case, Tori Noe, uh, Novi Noe, uh, is a meta metaphoric description of Theodosius of the caves, uh, Theodosi Pacharsky. So it belongs to the subgroup uh, Hagenoms, names of Ruthenian saints. Uh, to avoid uh, errors in the calculation, multi component stemmas of proper names were placed at the beginning. Uh, the next uh, uh, stage, uh, of uh, compilation, uh, the frequency dictionary is a uh, limitization. Um, it was made manually. Uh, each uh, lemma proper name represents a set of stammers. Uh, it's word forms uh, that have the same lexical meanings and correspond to the same proper name. Uh, due to different graphic representation of the same sound, uh, stemmas belonging to the same lemma, we say, for example, could also look as follows. Uh, here you can see the parallel spellings, uh, spelling of on and ought uh, in uh, these uh, stems. Uh, for example, uh, the uh, synonym uh, Jesus Christ uh, with the greatest number of phonetic and orthographic variants, uh, we have uh, 85 uh, variants of uh, uh, this uh, synonym in the text. Uh, sometimes in the text representation of proper names, um, uh, we have variants of a uh, set of stemmas. Uh, which consisted of um, word combinations, for example, Diva Maria, Tsaritsa Nebesnaya Maria, Matri Tsarya Nebesnaya, etc. Um, the study uh, proved that uh, multi component proper names in the text may have up to seven components, uh, thus increasing the number of variants. Um, on the basis of uh, the dictionary of proper names uh, in Rdevelovsky sermons, the proper names were divided into 24 groups, uh, which are as follows. You can see here biblical uh, anthroponyms, theonyms, Christian theonyms, um, names uh, denoting Slavic uh, deities, names of Rusinian princes, um, names of uh, seven wonders of the world, etc. And statistical data. Uh, the uh, numerical da data was obtained through a specially developed Python scripts. Uh, the total number of words in the text is um, uh, 51,821. Uh, we have 270 unique proper name lemmas, um, which formed 811 unique word forms. Uh, the total number of proper names in the text or the absolute frequency is 200, uh, 2,618. 
Uh, it means that a unique lemma or a unique word form could be presented several times in the uh, text. The percentage coverage of the text with proper names um, is uh, mm, uh, 0 0.050. It's uh, the ratio between the total number of proper names in the text and the total number of words in the text. Uh, we uh, calculated as well the diversity of proper name vocabulary, uh, the ratio between the total number of proper name lemmas and the total number of proper names in the text, uh, the onomastic diversity of the text, um, and uh, uh, we uh, have um, 123 um, proper names with frequently with frequency one, so-called uh, hapax uh, uh Here uh, you can see uh, the um, uh, 20, uh, 24 uh, groups of uh, homonyms uh, and uh, their frequency uh, in the text. And on the uh, left uh, side of the screen, you can see uh, the usage frequency of proper name groups sorted in the uh, decreasing frequency uh, or order. Um, the, uh, you can see that uh, the highest frequency group is uh, theonyms, uh, Christian theonyms uh, with the 100 uh, 1,265 uh, word tokens, then come biblical anthroponyms with uh, 355 and uh, hagianoms, uh, names of saints and martyrs, um, 